What's going on guys, Son of Beast here. We're back for another NBA Eastern Conference Finals. And as for being said, the Clippers have gotten defeated right over the other team of Phoenix Suns as they are on their way and they made it all the way to the finals. And now they have to wait until someone makes the win in the Eastern Conference section of the board. Now the Sixers are at Milwaukee to face against the Bucks in game three and four. Starting off in game three, we're about to see what happens with this time. It's the tie series 1-1 in the game. Sixers and Bucks, who will take the lead first? And as are being said, there may not be anything going on, but you may not know what will happen. There's a choice for them to enjoy. And if you're enjoying the events of Olympics, you don't want to miss this one out. The one of the best U.S. U.S. Uh, competitor that has done it all for each event. Well, there might be more on its way. You never know what to guess it before the final day of day 17 will be on August 8th. So you cannot miss this one, player of one of one of the incredible games of my teams, my career, part of the MVP and also amazing uh, amazing cards that you have earned. Well, there might be all of them that we had, but there may not be anything going on with you. So, it looks like they're heading down to the locker room and this is what they do to come inside and start the pregame of the warm-ups. So right now, the good view of the city here of Milwaukee. It's turning out to be a great part here in game three, but not too much is happening. Well, let's get started off here as we step along to David Aldridge. Dave, what do you have us here for this time? Now look at Philadelphia's starting lineup. Harrison and B together in the middle. Seth Curry is out there with Simon Simmons. And Green in at the small four. And for Milwaukee, Giannis is the four with Lopez the five. Holiday out there with Dante DiVincenzo. And it's Middleton in at the three. Well, it seems like David Aldridge hasn't appeared yet in for Game 3 of the Eastern Conference Finals, but we'll have to wait for them for halftime. Oh, what a start for a Joel Embiid! He's picking up a slam dunk to pick it off. Well, there might be a lot of them, but there might be on the board. So we're going to have to see what happens for this part of the game. So the Sixers made a win for the tip-off in Game 3. Let's see what happens if they can do it again. Middleton makes a dunk as Brooke Lopez takes the assist. Here's Simmons. He never had his chance to take the, take the win here in game one after he was trying to face it all with the attack. But there might be a solution for him to just get up on the road. Curry makes a shot. He gets a second two-pointer on the board. First bucket of the night in game three. Jurality on Simmons. Simmons keeps a guard on him on Holiday without even pushing the pace up 
to go up ahead. Steven turns her back to Holiday, taking the two. Holiday, and it misses off the throw as Green rebounds it. First rebound here for the Sixers. Curry in the corner, drawing it back is Green. He only has his first rebound here in the first in the third game. Simmons drives forward, takes a drive, and he lays it up. Used the glass board to take the first two pointer on the board. Sixers are leading up by four. Drew Holiday on Simmons. Holiday up. Rebound by Arnold Cooper, and he goes in with the dunk. He manages to make one through as he has his first one to take the dunk here for the Greek freak of a unicorn. Now on the other hand is Curry. Curry right back to Green. We remember this one here back in the playoffs here, game one and two and three was at Philadelphia with and four. And I'm back here in game five, it was at Milwaukee once more. And that's what happens here last playoffs postseason. That was the Sixers that have been pulling out the gap here as Joel Embiid makes the buzz beater here in game four. A lot of hard comebacks here, but there's more to get things on the roll. So the first foul for the Bucks goes to Brook Lopez. He receives his first personal. And Seth Curry will shoot two at the free throw line. First free throw line for Curry is good. Of course, Team USA for the women's, they defeated against, uh, against uh, Japan on the other day. They're doing really well, making an excellent game here. And also, if you haven't seen the uh, other, other players, such, such as like Sue Bird or baseball, you know, they definitely destroyed the other team in a, in a start of the opening round for them after softball is being finished. Well, the gold medals for the standing was Japan in, for gold, the United States here in silver, or I meant to say USA, and I think it was Australia with a bronze medal. I'm not sure if I had it right. I'll have to take a look on Instagram just in case. Here's Green in the corner. Simmons lining up the three. First three-pointer. No good on a shot. DiVincenzo. Makes it around to Curry. He watches it go by and it goes in. Dante DiVincenzo takes the first one in there. Simmons grabbing the other way as their team lead up by two. Curry finds Green. He passes along to Embiid. Embiid right back to Green. Green to Embiid. Around Brooke Lopez and the shot was a squeeze tight. And he has a second bucket of the night. 80% for the Sixers and 50 for the Bucks. And we're under four minutes left here in the first quarter. DiVincenzo, what a good pass to Holiday. First assist will be on Dante DiVincenzo as Drew Holiday takes a second one here to make the drive and a layup drive. Bounce pass to Simmons. Commentator for reporting of David Aldridge is off. I will get it back on here at a halftime or in the post game. Six on a shot clock and a shot drive is off as the foul is whistled on Drew Holiday. His first and second team foul on the Bucks. Shooting two at the free throw line will be Ben Simmons. Another six or zero for another trip to the free throw line after Seth Curry. This is what is going to happen here. Just in case. First free throw is good. New changes here for the Sixers and the Bucks. Three players checked out. MB, Green, and the Bias, and Seth Curry, Bible, Hill, and D.Y. Howard are checked in. They're also making new changes for the Bucks. Steven Chenzo and Lopez are checked out. And it's Forbes and Bobby Portis checking in. For for those two. Ben Simmons can't hit the second one. It's only one out of two that he made. Forbes in the wing. Pass back to Holiday. Holiday on Hill. Outside Middleton. Three is off. Portis can't make the drive. A second chance is good. Bobby Portis has got his first rebound and his first bucket of the night. That's one and one for him. 
here for game number three. Howard, right back to Hill. You can see the, the cuttings is just getting a little bit off the target here. Seven to shoot. Bias errors around. Oh, bad angle. Bad angle here for Tobias Harris. It's Holiday up. And a good D here. Oh, it's Simmons with the block. What a play here. No foul on him. And Tobias Harris will carry out. And the drive is good. Good pass here by Ben Simmons as Tobias Harris gets his first bucket here for game three. Draw it up. On Tobias. Oh, he makes a good block. Another here, another one here, taking a big one. Pass to Tobias Harris, and it will get the second bucket. As George Hill will take the first assist here in game three. Middleton against Bible. Two minutes to go here and for the first. Middleton on the drive, and he makes one in. Timeout, Philadelphia. 15 to 12 is your score. As for being honest, Steve, it's already like it's already like to midnight here. I know this is the late game, but don't be honest with you. Because of all that happens, I wouldn't I won't record it at the for a late game. Very hard for me to, un to understand it. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to finish it as best I can, so I will not fail it at that point. Some new changes here for the Sixers as Markin Korkmaz is checked. Korkin. Uh. Freaking Korkmaz is checked in. Bible moves over to point forward and Shake Milton on the other hand is checking in. Has checked in for George Keel. I mean for Ben Simmons. Milton, Bible for three. He missed out. His first three pointer was missed off an opportunity on the run. Connaughton, Middleton with an open shot look, and it's no good. It's Dwight Howard with the first rebound. Checking it over is George Gill. Screen off the ball, just trying to work his way around. He finds Shape Milton. Only six to shoot. Goes over to B.J. Tucker. I mean, uh, Middleton and B.J. Tucker with the rebound. Connaughton on D.Y. Howard. His shot gets a little bit weakened. He fights over to Corncross. Moves over to 5 but it's tipped away. P.J. Tucker with the steal. First turnover on Philly. Connaughton for three. It's no good either. That's Howard with their second rebound of the game. Here's Milton. Pass over to freaking Corkmaz, and it's almost lost it to make a turnover. Back pass on Corkmaz. Back to Middleton, no choice to hear, and he makes a good three-point attempt. He's got his first three-pointer here, as they extend the lead by six. Middleton on Corkmaz. Middleton driving over, and he makes the play. Your team is, is trailing by four. 13 seconds to play here. 10 to go. Off to Milton. Back to Korkmaz. Korkmaz back to Milton. Hop around. Layup drive is good. Milton takes his five point game. And the first quarter has come to an end for the third game. It's 20 to 14. We'll be right back for the second quarter. Stay right here to the game and focus on the game and uh, let my, uh, you know, play, and my energy and my effort do the target for me. Well, as you can just see what happens here with Giannis Adokupo, he is noticing that he has been making a mistake about his trash talk without receiving his technical foul at that point. Sometimes he gets walked around here with his teammate as they did call him on Giannis Adokupo. Sometimes he's just too much to go with an unsportsmanship. It's too much for him to, uh, to answer what he was up to. 
So as the first shot makes it in for Tyrese Maxey, we welcome you back here for the second quarter as they're all fueled up and ready to go. DiVincenzo still trying to work his way around as he is trying to look forward to win game three over the Sixers. If they can do it, for good. Aliou gets away. It's not enough for him to make the advantage. Maxi the Fievel. Fievel right to Korkmaz. He taking around a bit. Korkmaz up. Rebound away. Embiid. Block the pass. It's Connaughton with the takeover. Connaughton right around Embiid. Tucker still finding way. Forbes up. The three pointer is missed away. Maxi with the ball, he will try to look at it as he gets his first bucket here in game three. Right around again, Fiebel. Over to Milton. Taking it in step, around. Shot is off the mark. We received another foul. It's on Brooke Lopez, his second, third team foul on Milwaukee. The Bucks are having a hard time to take a look around again to try to fight their way through. It's not totally easy for them to just score, but this is whatever happens if they try to hit or not. Shooting two. Here it is, shooting two is Brooke Lopez. I mean, Shake Milton. First free throw is good. New change coming back in is Curry, Danny Green, and Ben Simmons. He will take Maxi, Fievel, and Korkmaz. And Forbes is checked out as Drew Holiday is checked in. Ben Simmons on a point forward. You have to see what he can do. Second free throw for Milton is good. He has seven points right now on the board. DiVincenzo on Curry. Double man carry. And Simmons taking the steal and they will have to restart it from the top. Finds Milton. Back to Ben Simmons. Curry right up going to go around PJ Tucker. Milton outside. Looking around, Arnie gets away. Well, it's not comfortable to make the shot, and here's a foul called on the Sixers. It will be Seth Curry with the first personal, first team foul on Philadelphia. And right now, shooting for the free throw line is Dante DiVincenzo. He will take his first look here in game three to take free throw attempts at the free throw line. New changes are coming up after the first shot. Shot's good. Ida Cooper will check in. Ben Simmons will move over to point full point guard as he sub as Harris checks in for Milton. And PJ Tucker's out as Ida Cooper is checked back in. Magree free. You gotta watch out for him. He's coming right at you. Dante DiVincenzo hits two free throws at the free throw line. They're coming up. Under five minutes here, Ben Simmons pass to Tobias Harris. That's going to be a good assist here for Ben Simmons. Another shot for Tobias Harris and has got six points up ahead. Meanwhile, Holiday taking a drive here. Another assist here on Dante DiVincenzo. They're working their way up a bit. Simmons try to work his way around, try to, try to help the teammate out. Over or under, Embiid. Back to Simmons. Back to Embiid. Embiid to Curry with the shot. In and out. It missed off the rim. Connaughton, DiVincenzo. Missed the three. He couldn't able to save it. Harris went to Curry. Curry has gotten away with the pass. Connaughton rolling over to DiVincenzo. Holiday for three. It didn't go in there. 
Another three-point missed opportunity run is on the Milwaukee. Curry tries again. The other lane is off the mark. They have to slow down. Oh, they up. We have a three-pointer for the Bucks. As Drew Holiday takes his first three on the board. Tobias Harris right to Curry. Milwaukee Bucks trail by five. Embiid inside, and a third foul calls up Brooke Lopez. This will be their fourth team foul on Milwaukee Bucks. Yeah, you never, really never know what's going to happen to you. This is in trouble for, for the Bucks to keep an eye on after they had a hard time here in second game. But this isn't what we are thinking. A lot of hard time happens. Embiid hits the first one. New change here for the Bucks. Connaughton's checked out. Middleton's checked in for the starting five. Embiid hits the second free throw. He has six points in the game. He's trying to work his way up. Now here's Ayana Kupo, he wasn't able to score it. Holiday making the dunk. Ayana Kupo take the assist. The Greek Freak has won. Ed Simmons kicks it off to Curry. Now it's Simmons back again. Right over under, Embiid. Embiid right to Simmons. He goes up, lost the ball. It's Brooke Lopez with the steal. DiVincenzo hits the dunk. And just like Drew Holiday did, they're down by three. Simmons kicks out to Harris. Harris to Simmons. Harris right to Embiid. Back to Embiid. Over Brooke Lopez. And shot doesn't go in there. It's Donna Kumpo with the rebound. And DiVincenzo up. Three! Dante DiVincenzo gets his first three-pointer of the game. Curry out in the wing. Pass back to Simmons. He's going to try this again. 2-10 remaining. Simmons, oh boy, he never quits here. And Simmons has a good drive up in this in the alley. Only two minutes left here in the third half. DiVincenzo on Curry. That shot gets him tough, but he makes it in. Timeout on Philadelphia, Sixers. This is what the team was looking for, and now they never know what to expect to come from the biggest, toughest of all. It's hard for them to keep an eye on them, but not enough for them to score. I'm gonna pick another one here. Let's try it with another offensive look. Let's keep it on, let's keep it going with the Patient and a little limit and three legs. Everything will be okay. Promise me. Here are some new changes here. D.Y. Howard and George Hill. Also with uh, Tyrese Maxey, they will be checking in for two or three players from Seth Curry, Ben Simmons, and Joel Embiid. Lopez is only checked out, and Bobby Portis is checking back in to do it again. George Hill, tough shot, but he makes one in. He has his first pointer of the game. We're only about 90 seconds left here for the first half. Middleton against Green. Screen on Girolade. And a first foul. Is called on George Hill. Second team foul on Philadelphia. Right now, shooting two at the free throw line will be Chris Middleton at, for two shots. Chris Middleton, he was able to be on his road 
after their team wins the finals, he was able to make his way to head to the road. And with most careers that he has been facing out, he's one of the top biggest player here. Best player, I meant, that he has at all. After playing in the G League, he is now wanting to transfer things to the NBA and follow his along season along with the others. How well can you do? There might be a choice for him to score big here. Good cut in for George Hill as he gets right around jo Drew Holiday. 34-32. Bucks trail by two with one minute left. And we got a foul first called on Tyrese Maxey. And on another team foul. That's number four for Philadelphia. And right now, Drew Holiday will go to the second trip to the free throw line, shooting two. A lot of hard contact here on the on the mission to get things on the on the control. Very hard for him to stop by, and they wanted to tie things up really quickly. First throw, it's a little bit off the mark. Ah, the Kupo's checked out. P.J. Tucker's checked back in. No fouls for him. He's doing all right. He made only one. And now we'll push up ahead with Lutrelli. Hill right to Green. Bounce pass right back to Hill. Almost get to turn it over here on, right on the box. Green to Maxi. Screen on Howard. He jumps up. Rebound by Howard. He will take it back in. And he will have a fadeaway shot right on the Belong. Just a good shot here for uh, D. White Howard to pick it up, but only 30 seconds left to play here in the first half. Forbes on Tyrese Mexi. He's driving in. Holiday up. In and out. Bobby Bordas with the rebounder, and he finishes off nice and quick. Looks like they're trailing back up again. Hill right to Maxi. Back to Hill. 10 seconds to play here in the first half. George Hill making the three. He doesn't go in that time. And they're taking a half court. Oh, almost. But it didn't go in that time. So that means the half time is on. It's 36 to 35. We'll be right back with you after this one. Don't go anywhere. More highlights of green coverage. How did the team's offensive approach improve in the first half? Thanks for your time. Back to you, Kevin. Thank you, DA. Please stand by for the first half. Second half will begin after this. And for those of you who are joining in, welcome back to the second half of the Game 3 of NBA Eastern Conference Finals. Last time we checked on DiVincenzo. At that point, he has making history for this tonight. 11 points, 4 out of 5, and 10 minutes on the court. He's playing really well out there. He's just trying to work his way around here to find a fear deer of Giannis and the other teams. So thank you for joining us for the first half, but now it's time to meet the second half. The foul star in trouble. That will be on Joel Embiid, first personal. So that happened here in game in the last game, number two. It was not enough for them to make a to make a quick coverage here to make it up. Chris Middleton, heading back to the free throw line for the second time. That hits him for the first free throw. Looks like they're looking for a way to make the lead up by one if they can try to fix it off. He hits the second. 
Their team is up by one. Ben Simmons has the ball. He will take it on the other hand. She slows it down, finds Curry. Now a change up here on offense for the Sixers. Up and overhead on the pass. Or around on the Kumbo and he's fouled. And there you go, there's your first foul that turned out to be a foul on the loose Giannis Anacubo. Here's first team foul has originated on Milwaukee Bucks for the second half. Tobias Harris going back to the free throw line and he is going to try to try this one once more. First free throw went in there just like he did before. He makes a second. Tobias Harris is reaching out here for eight points of the night, but it's hard for him to keep an eye on it. Not too much happening out there, but it's just very hard for him to keep it up. And now the next shot up for the layup is Dante DiVincenzo, 13 points, 8 in the paint. Embiid, working your way around. Curry, right back to Embiid. Find the inside, oh! Oh, the Greek Freak has rejected the shot on Tobias Harris. Oh, Ben Simmons got it back! And Green will have to finish it from here, just like that. Ben Simmons has got his second steal of the game, another turnover on the Bucks. They have it back out in the lead. Beat Dante DiVincenzo to Anacupo. He only makes one block here at the game. Drew Holiday, he slams it right around that bead. And a great play here by Giannis Anacupo. They're on a back-to-back -back score. Embiid, oh boy. And yep, he made a dunk. That's going to be number four on Brooke Lopez. Another team foul on Milwaukee. And Brooke Lopez is in trouble. He only has two fouls left to give. If the next one has occurred, then it's number five. Joel Embiid, one free throw left to play here for the third quarter. is in for Joel Embiid as he's got nine points on the board. Only 5.20 left here for the third quarter. Brooke Lopez has to be in careful shape here without being fouled out. Dante DiVincenzo working his way over finds Brooke Lopez and that shot's good. Dante DiVincenzo making his way to tie this, to tie this game up 43. Five minutes left, Embiid again, and that's what he had done before. Embiid rolls out, 11 points on the game. Drew Holiday on Ben Simmons. Not a good defense here. Oh, Curry got out of the way. First block for him. Embiid, right to Curry. Embiid in the corner. He's trying to fight his way around a bit. Again, shot missed, Embiid has it back. Harris tries to work his way around as Fievel will come in by. Pass that Simmons, four to shoot. Oh, taking a little bit off the angle here, but no traveling violation called here for the Sixers. Simmons is making this work way around here. He has been pulling out seven points on the making. And right now they're up ahead by four. First time out for the third quarter calls for Milwaukee Bucks with 4.06 remaining. It's hard for him to stop by, but that won't count for him to keep an eye on the time. So as it being said, I'm going to sub out Tobias Harris for once. This time, bring my Scott in. I'm going to give him a shot. Actually, nope. 
George Hill, Ben Simmons, I just don't have anything to say about it for his coverage. And then we'll just pick up a two to three zone so we don't have to stick with the man to man. No change over here. Brooke Lopez is still on the court, but only has received four fouls in this game. DiVincenzo, finding his way forward, passes to Middleton. Middleton has to cover here to make it inside. Ali -oop. Oh! It looks like Chris Middleton got lucky enough that he made an alley -oop successful. As the Avers are having a struggle here in, over this one. Hilton, I mean, Hill, right over to MB. White finding Simmons. Ooh. With the shot made. White to Fiebel. Four to shoot. Shots running out of time. MB up. Missed the shot. And it's taken away by Middleton. Middleton, another alley oop. And it's carried out. As another rejection here on that call, Simmons fights it through here. He has making another two-pointer. And he's tied up with nine points from Joel Embiid. 3.05 remaining here in the third quarter. On the Kupo inside. And he's fouled by Joel Embiid. His second personal, second team foul on Philadelphia. They stopped the clock at 3.01 left to play here. And Giannis will have to send him off to the free throw line to shoot two. Shoot two. The Canara like never before. Maybe the first free throw wasn't that bad. New changes here. Brooke Lopez is checked out as Giannis moves over to the center. P.J. Tucker and Forbes are checked in. It's the second free throw. Well play on that run. Free throws in between here looking in comfortable shape. Nothing has happened yet to make a change up. Bounce pass on Fibo. He finds a look on Milton. Now he rolls over the hill. And beat inside. Around out of the Kumpo. He makes that shot. Heavy contest here, but he makes it. Another two pointer here. Joel Embiid has 13. Diva Chanzo on hill. Middleton outside. Anakubo working around the middle. Milton has it covered. Six to shoot. DiVincenzo for three. Missed it out. Another miss by the Bucks. And Beat almost lost it. But this time they will have to reset it from the top. We're down to two minutes here in the third quarter as they are not able to get this in enough strength. And B working their way around here. 15 points. 150 left in here. And they're all channeling. Let's go, Bucks. Go, Bucks, go, I meant. I'm sorry. Tucker up. Three pointer. Will not carry his run on a streaking score. Three on one. It's good for Ben Simmons. Well playing enough for a five ball as he picking up another assist in this one. 11 points for Simmons, 10 in the paint. Not a Kupo on Milton. Oh, oh! The Greek freak. He has rolled around Milton. And around Embiid. Well, we're done with the play. Timeout on the Sixers. I never seen that one here before, but you cannot remember that the Fango was definitely seeing things coming around here that fast. Wow. It's not that tough. Always not easy to bring it up here. I'm subbing out those two. 
D.Y. Howard, I'm checking in, and of course, I'm going to have uh, Tobias Harris check back in. Let's try another one. Another different group changing. Of course, the Sixers are always bringing out of another control. As Milton is checked out, Tyrese Maxey will check in. Also with Green as well, and Tobias Harris. Arna Cooper, he's just gone killed already. Now he will now move over to small forward. He's not going to take in good shape here, but he's going to try to see what he can do. Four to shoot. Finding D.Y. Howard with the shot. Rebounded by Tobias Harris. And a good solid D on the Bucks. Drew Holiday picking up another rebound here. An open look. Shot fade out. Bobby Portis is rolling inside again. He's looking for his way to make a win here in game three. 35 seconds left to go. Hill finds Tobias Harris. That's an easy shot for Tobias Harris. 10 points in the game. Looks like Danny Green had the assist, if I'm correct or not. Drew Holiday. On Maxi, double man to cover. And now it's Hill making a help out there. DiVincenzo missed the three, doesn't go in that time. Sixers lead by eight. Now it's up to Green. Hill outside, three to shoot. With a run, DeWay Howard. The shot will not count. That will be the end of the third. It's 57 to 51. Can the Bucks win the, four, the finals quarter? Or will the Sixers take the lead 2-1? Will we see what happens when we come back? It's now time to present the, the player of the game, of the of the game, presented by State Farm. One more look here as a good pass on Joel Embiid as he was like fouled already. It looks like Ben Simmons and Joel Embiid are working their way up to the next level. I mean, they're reaching as the All-Stars as much here, but Joel Embiid, he's a superstar. He could be a legendary player to go for the process if he can keep it up. But right now, he will have to see if he can try to manage his way to give it another one. Final quarter started. Let's see if the Bucks can win the third game. Green missing a lot, and it's on a Kumbo. Holiday on the run. Oh! Did you see that? It's Dwight Howard with the rejection. And one more time here on another look. Well play on that run. He was right on the back. No foul on him. Well done. He was right on Drew Holiday. He was picking up another run out there. And now Chris Middleton will check in for Giannis Antetokounmpo as he will hydrate himself with the Gatorade fuel. All chanting, go Bucks, go, again. Holiday up. Three! Drew Holiday! Curry again. Right to Hill. You're down by three. Howard right to Curry. Bounce pass to Harris. Double man covered. Curry. Moving up, finds Harris, and the drive is good. Curry takes another assist. It's 12 points on the run for Tobias Harris. Holiday. Hills head out. Three! Chris Milton! Curry again. Pass, bounce pass to Howard. Right to Curry. Another three-point look. In and out it goes. Another miss by Philadelphia Sixers. DiVincenzo up for two. And he will take a tie look on the run with 59. 15 for DiVincenzo. Eight in the paint. Curry looking over again. That's back to Howard. Back to Curry. Back to Howard. Back to Curry, another ball changing here as Screen will take a look on Howard. Up and over again. Nice speed here for Curry. He gets another assist. 
Another timeout called by Milwaukee Bucks. They have the lead up by two, and they're just good enough to try to see if they can hold it up again to make another run. It's hard for him to stop again in this run. Not enough for them to score if they can try to keep it going as long as they can. I'm going to need to see what they can do here if they want to eliminate, push the pace, and pick and rolls. That's just it. New changes here coming in for the Sixers and the Bucks as Hills checked out. And right now, coming back in, it's Ben Simmons. He's working his way. Time off. Three! Dante DiVincenzo! And also, Brooke Lopez is back in the game. He only has received four fouls at this point. He has to be careful if he gets another one. Howard, right to Curry, thinking about no traveling here. Nice shot. Curry was making a tough shots here to go heavy. But he has six points in this game as he's still up by one. Holiday on Simmons. 4.30 left to go. He's still on it. Six on the shot clock. Floaters up. And it's good. They're up by one again. Drew Holiday is working his way up to the next career if he picks up another run in the series. Howard's still trying to work again. Curry, right to Green. Green, back to Curry. Four minutes to go. Simmons carrying out the three. The first one. I mean, the second attempt for the three-pointer is no good. Harris in the paint. He's trying to get away from himself. Five to go. Howard up again. They're out of time. Green, can he do it? No, he could not face it off. And the Bucks are coming back in the game as he's trying to work his way along if he wanted to extend it. Vichen DiVincenzo missed a three-pointer. He didn't have it all. Simmons right to Tobias Harris. Curry, Howard up. Good D here for Lopez, as no foul is being carried. Oh, and there's a foul! That's going to be Danny Green! He had the ball, but unfortunately, he has been whipped out right on the other player. And that will be off the limit for him to score, stopping the clock at 3.12 to remain here in the fourth quarter. And a lot of complaints out there on the on the court is just not working out that well. And this is what happens to him. A tough timing on the run. It's too much for them to think of the process. First free throw is down in. Now Joel Embiid will take it care for D.Y. Howard. He's back in the starting five. Giannis Anacumbo is also in two for P.J. Tucker. As you can see, Dante DiVincenzo, he has another step high for his career. He's high in this game, but maybe he could be trying enough to make his way on the game. Simmons, drawing with the fade, three minutes to play. And be up again. Go well, against Anacupo, the Greek freak, and he's making a tough layup on the air. Only a two pointer doesn't want to carry out at the three. Dante DiVincenzo, three point lead over Joel Embiid, 17 points. And it comes around again. Gerardo makes a shot. Timeout, Philadelphia. Well play out there for Gerardo. And there we've got a lot of moment out there. This is just enough to make the history come by, and this one, very hard for him to stop in, but this is more that he has been playing out again and again. I'll step out, I'm stepping out to my ass Harris, I'm going to bring back um, George Hill, and Ben Simmons will carry it out from a point forward position. I'm stepping out Danny Green and Matisse Feibel, checking in as well. And finally, Seth Curry out, Shake Gooden in. 
And I'm gonna try to fix one of us one of the this time because that didn't work. The little, little average here, just get one of the picking rules here. We're gonna need to try to see what happens. And now let's present the new balance player of the game for the Bucks. This one goes out to Drew Holiday. Not to believe him, but this is what he has been carrying out so far in one of the matchups that he has been faced out. This is what everyone was talking about. Drew Holiday, you can't go wrong with him. How well does he have to do? Well, there, were, there wasn't any choice. So it looks like we're almost done for the third game. If you guys are enjoying it, then uh, I hope you uh, I hope you appreciate it that time. Hill, two million. Billing. No cut-ins yet. They're going to need to try to figure it out. Matisse Tweibel. He's trying to work his way around a bit. Figuring out Milton to tie it. Can he make it? No, he still does not have enough to go for the three-pointers again. Holiday to Tweibel. Billing. Di three-pointer. He's out of fuel. He's slowly blowing down. Working a close run out there. It's George Hill with the assist with under two minutes left. And has got 19 on a run. Following a one-point trail. Brooke Lopez with the screen. Lopez with the three. He doesn't go in that time. Another miss by Milwaukee. Fiebel working the way around. Hill for three. He missed off again. And it doesn't work out for him, as always. Lockdown position slowing down. Free Dante DiTento! And the fans goes wild in Florida, Milwaukee. Also the Deer District. Oh, George Hill had the pull, post in. He pulls it up, squeezing pass by. Six points on a run. Anacupo, oh, rejected by the process of MB, and now the foul will be given by Ben Simmons with 1.11 to go. Not just the only mistakeable run out there, but that was just way off. I give it off to an early lead to give it off just a bit of a start on it as they can. Two shots coming for Chris Middleton. Oh, he missed the first one, but that's okay. If he makes the second one, that means the Sixers may have a chance to tie it or not. He hits that one. The Sixers are needing to try to focus on and get their attention. Looks like they're trying to pick it up a bit. Hill, right to Middleton. Rolling back to Hill. Back to Middleton. And Bede, he's trying to work his way along a bit. He's thinking about a three. Rebound by Simmons. Grabbing it back by Milton. Over again, 5-0 with the tie. It does not go in. DiVincenzo receiving another rebound out there. Gerade working in. With a two. Yes! The progress has made so far a better decision. Bailton. Right to Hill. Millen taking a three. Grabs out early and reaching on the personnel is Joel Embiid. His third foul. Team foul makes it up uh, Philadelphia number three. And one on two shots is on the Greek freak of Giannis Antetokounmpo. A lot of play progress out there. We'd love to hear it. He makes that one. 
If he makes it again, and that, and that means the Bucks will take the lead from here. Oh my goodness, the fans are going wild out there. They're just trying to work their way around. He makes a second. It looks like the Bucks are heading their way to game four if they can keep it up. Oh my goodness, MB. He says 21 points, and that's his number. Now that that were personal fouls on carried out for the Sixers, Philadelphia brought Ben Simmons on the second. Drew Holiday shooting two at the free throw line to take it from here. Holiday makes the first. One more shot left. He makes that one. Last time out held on the Philadelphia Sixers. Only 18.7 seconds right there, and their teams are getting tired here for the for the late for the latest game here in game three. That's what ever happens here before when somebody gets tired out there. They always need to, uh, they always need to just calm themselves down. I'm not sure what else to say about that one, but this might be hard for them to, to, under, to understand about that more. Change up here. We're gonna make another another change up. And we only got a last group of change here as all players. Last five players making changes out there. Hill, right to Fievel. We pick up a three. It doesn't go in at time. That will be Carthy Kitten Kara, Jeff T to close the gap of the third game. And that does it here, folks. Bucks win the series, wins the game, and they pick up a lead 2-1. 78 to 71 is your final score. Well done, well done they had. Let's carry out the David Aldrich on the finishing court side. David? Thanks, Kevin. Giannis, a hard fought win for you tonight. What gave you all the advantage? Maybe just uh, sticking our game plan. Uh, move the ball. Uh, as I said, we move the ball offensively. Thank you, DA. Thank you for watching for the third game of the Bucks versus the Sixers. If you'd like to check out the previous playoff position of the Bucks versus Sixers, make sure you find it here on the video on 2K20. That will be the uh, the other one that will be facing out here, just like last time that I did a video before. And we'll be back here for game four of the Bucks vs. Sixers. No games here for the Western Conference Finals as the Suns are in, the, are in the finals to wait for the winning team to head on to the NBA Finals. So that's going to be it for right now. Peace out, bitches, for us a while as the NBA Eastern Conference Finals dial. We'll see you all next time in game four. Good night in Milwaukee of the Bucks, fearing the deer. Thank mm -hmm. you. You've probably heard how Tony is so famous. In fact, you've probably heard how Tony was the greatest. I'm black and proud, honestly, I'm fateless. But y'all whack clown smirk, y'all think I'm faking. But truth be told, y'all turds, y'all just hating. And y'all yearn for rooms is gold in my rankings. All y'all fakest haters, traitors, y'all are Satan. Y'all keep saying y'all will make it, I'm still waiting.